In 2 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 11, in the Amplified Version, the scripture says to keep Satan from getting the advantage over us, for we are not ignorant of his wiles and his intentions. There are intentions, there are wiles of the enemy targeted against you to pull you out of destiny fulfillment. One of Satan's greatest weapon against us as believers is ignorance. Satan wants to keep you in the dark. He wants to keep you ignorant of your identity. He wants to keep you ignorant of God. He wants to keep you ignorant of the victory that Christ already made available unto us. And what he also wants to achieve is to make a contribution in whatever God is doing in your life. But as believers, you have the legal right, you have that authority and power to exercise dominion over the enemy. In James chapter 4 verse 7, the Bible says, resist the devil and he will flee. What you don't resist, you will retain. So you have the authority as a believer to resist whatever Satan is bringing to you today. So I declare and I speak this word into your life that whatever Satan is doing in your life will put an end to those things right now in the name of the Lord Jesus. You will not service the agenda of the enemy in the name of Jesus. I declare you will not fall into the master plan of the enemy in the name of Jesus. You will not follow the instructions. You will not follow the direction of the enemy because the voice of strangers you will not hear. Here. So I declare that the light of the Lord will shine upon your heart. It will shine upon your path in the name of Jesus. You will walk at the highest frequency of divine direction in the name of the Lord Jesus. You will see with your eyes. You will hear with your ears and your heart will conceive that which God is bringing to you in the name of the Lord Jesus. I declare you will not embrace whatever Satan is bringing to you and you will not reject what God is offering you in this season in the name of the Lord Jesus. So I commend you to God and to the word of his grace, which is able to build you up and to give you an inheritance amongst them which are sanctified. Amen. God bless you.